great to be back on my positive perspective with you. It's great. It's great. Thank you for coming back. Well, this is for season two. Season two, yes. Yeah. So it's, it's a good moment. Yeah. Very cool. You know, last time you said you nailed it. Hopefully, <clears throat> we nail it this time, not failed it. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Hopefully. So, but back to, uh, you know, the whole thing that you started this year with Kinetic Hi Fi. Yeah. You're partnering with them, right? My positive perspective. My positive perspective is partnering with Kinetic. And, um,. I have a uh, six to seven on Wednesdays. I, I, I do a radio talk show, um, but uh, r really the uh, the reason that all came about was I wanted to have a, a, a music a, a musical outlet, and um, we're uh, going to be uh, doing uh, live concerts through the radio. And I come and I MC them from the uh, radio standpoint. <clears throat> um, Last night we did Esti Gavai, who had a, a fabulous cool. concert. Yeah. And um, she's a very, very talented a woman, real young musician. But we also have, you know, Ben Fagan, yes. Adam Siegler, uh, uh, Jameson, who's, who's another local guy, and, and uh, Father's Mustache. Very um, nice. Yes. And I love that you're doing, like, local talent, getting the word out. You oh, know, we're, we're very fortunate in Charleston to have a lot of musical talent around us. And yeah. we don't need to go very far to do it. So uh, I said, "Boy, if you're gonna run a radio station, <laughs> let's do some concerts. Let's, let's, let's have fun with it, you know." Absolutely. Well, um, <clears throat> and another thing I want to do, you know, I love putting you in the hot seat this time. Sure. <laughs> it's so yeah. much fun for me. Yeah. Um, and and part of you know you researching you, one of the things that I saw was that you were you were the recipient of the 2011 Scoia Award. Yeah. And so, what what exactly does that stand for? Yeah, that, that was the South Carolina Outstanding Young American. And it, it, it was with the, the JCs. And uh, the JCs are one of those organizations. I, I love helping out nonprofit organizations. And um, what, what, what they do is they help people that need help. And as you know from reading my book, Return from a Coming to yeah. This Mind, I was, in, I was once in a, a phase of my life where I needed help from others. And one of the things I always told myself I never, I, I would never forget would be that time when I needed help from others. And if I ever was in the position to help others, I would do, take full advantage of yeah, it. Like struggling authors like myself? Like yourself. <laughs> <laughs> there, there's so many, right? But, uh, <laughs> but no, it's really, it, it's awesome. And as you know, that's what really touched me. I mean, I read your book and what, you know, how you overcame adversity, to put it mildly in mm -hmm. that. And, um... And part of the thing that you do in, in, in getting awareness out there is that you actually um, have interviewed people like the lovely model inside and out, Jennifer Torkev. Jennifer Torkev, yeah, with her her son and her her son has autism, and, and, and right. the whole thing thing we did with him, we got in the water with him, and and he swam, um, and, and, and and that was really to, to symbolize that. With autistic children, you, you can't just medicate them and expect them to be fine. You need to get them, encourage them to exercise, release endorphins. Those are the types of things that do a lot of good for children with autism. Of course, exercise is, is important in all children, but when they release, but when you have a, an autistic child, endorphins are important because they help. They help uh, supplement the uh, symptom, yeah. really. Well, you know, I get endorphins <clears throat> just showing up on my positive perspective. Yeah, so right. <laughs> I would recommend people coming on this show for that. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> um, and so let me let me talk a little bit more though about um, you know the kinetic hi fi. Where do you see the partner partnering with that going? I mean, um, like what kind of audience does it reach as far as um, you know the, the broadcasting? Yeah, the well, uh, you know, uh, there are. They're young and starting, just like my company, and we're really, you know, trying to, to better enable our, our, our listeners to just have extra avenues. Very cool. Very yeah. cool. So it's growing. It's growing. Yeah. It's growing, and yeah. It's so good. now, Jason, I've got to put this to a halt because I bring it to a close. Um, sure. I, I yeah. know we're limited on time, but it's been so much fun. And tell me that well, I'll get to interview you again. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'll, I'm, 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 did we nail that's it? For sure. We didn't that's fail for sure. it. We did okay. good. We did good. Yeah. <laughs> Awesome. <laughs> well, thank, thank you for tuning in to My Positive Perspective. Uh, Wednesdays, eight, six, 6 to 7, we'll be on Kinetic High Fi. And uh, the season 2 uh, has arrived, so feel free to leave a comment on us. And uh, thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next episode. Yeah.